Welcome back friends. It is Jen from Clean Living with Jen. Today I have something really super exciting to share with you guys. We're currently in the process of finishing our basement and you guys know I love the farmhouse decor. I'm going to carry that through down in the basement. So we have this empty space right here that I really wanted to utilize by making some cabinets. And I kind of came up with a design and an idea and then I gave it to my husband and I said, go ahead, have at it, because he is just so excellent at creating things and bringing my visions to life. So as you'll see this empty space here, I wanted cabinets on the bottom that kind of would have a countertop. And then I wanted some additional cabinets up top. So I'm going to show you guys the before, and then I'm going to show you what he got and kind of as we go through it, I figured we're doing this stuff, so I might as well share it with you anyways. So he did pick up some of this veneer edging. These are the materials that we grabbed, and we just grabbed them from the hardware store. This is like his department, so forgive me if I don't say things properly. So we have some particle board screws here, and then we have another container of screws. And we just got these big, massive sheets of... I'm not even sure, some kind of wood here. Love all the wood grain in there. And then we did get several packages of this premium knotty pine. It's like a paneling. So after about a week, week and a half, maybe two weeks here, this is what he had already. My husband does work full time. So, you know, he can only do this in the evenings if he's sealing up to it and weekends. And then this is about three weeks later, he had it all completed. The weekends are also busy too because that's our time to try and get everything else accomplished that we can't during the week when everybody's working. But you guys, I'm so proud of him. I'm so, I can't believe he built this by hand. It's exactly what I wanted. I absolutely love it. We decided to go with a very natural, just a natural finish to kind of seal the wood, but also to be able to see all that beautiful natural wood grain i just love it i love the hardware he chose i love how he did the little cross design and he did put some tile underneath the cabinet for me and we still have to trim the carpet up around the bottom there um, actually we may even end up removing the carpet and put a different flooring down i'm not sure yet but i love the live edge countertop it is so beautiful i love all the knots how you can just see all the wood grain through this created so much storage space for us to just contain stuff out of the way and you won't even see it. I think we went with a satin finish. I'm not sure if I mentioned that already. I did all the staining. He did the building and I just did the finishing touches there. Cabinet is exactly what I wanted. It's extra special to me because my husband built it. It's a custom cabinet. I would love for you guys to leave me your comments down below. Let me know what you think. The doors just open and close perfectly. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I figured I'd share some of these projects with you because we're finishing the basement. We have a lot of uh, unique ideas. So we do do a lot of these kind of DIY projects ourselves. We enjoy doing these projects ourselves rather than just going out and buying everything. It's really rewarding when you sit back and you look at something and you say, yes, we did that, we worked on that, we created that. Thanks for watching everyone. If you're new, make sure to subscribe. I hope you all have an awesome rest of your day. I'll be back to share lots more fun with you all real soon. Take care.